Hey guys, it's Regant here and today I'm going to show you how you can build this bamboo or wood farm. Um, since the 1.2 update you can craft wood out of bamboo. So theoretically this is a wood farm because you can craft wood out of the bamboo. So let's go. First of all the material list. So before we start I'm going to explain the farm a little bit to you. If you go below the farm here you're gonna see we have like a collecting system down here with many mine uh, hopper mine cards that are collecting the bamboo that's getting dropped up here. And then you see all this bamboo growing here and this little flying machine here. This is this one is gonna harvest the bamboo. You see in front of if the bamboo reaches the observers, these two observers here, uh, the machine is gonna start and harvest every single bamboo off um, because there will be a signal and. We can show you, we can also activate the farm here manually. So I'm gonna show you this one real quick. There we go. And now you see the uh, flying machine is starting and harvesting all of the bamboo. The bamboo is getting dropped on the ground and uh, the uh, minecarts are collecting them. So the water is just avoiding uh, losing uh, bamboo because you see, otherwise it would get stuck over there. And now the machine goes back and waits uh, till the next bamboo grows. So very simple farm. This is just uh, like a signal that uh, sends the machine back. So nothing special here, but yeah, very simple farm and let's start building. So we start by building a 28 by 20 area that is two blocks deep. After we got this, it would look like this. And then we go to somewhere around the middle. It, this will just be the collecting system that doesn't have to be like right in the middle. Just dig out here like two blocks and a uh, staircase outwards so we can go out of our collecting system again. And just place a double chest right here. So this position doesn't really matter. So it's because, yeah, put two helpers on top of it and then dig out these two rows here they on the left and right side of the hoppers and put hoppers leading into the main hoppers leading into the chest in a row so we get all the items in the chest so next we go here and leave one row a uh, one row block gap between the hoppers and this one and put we're gonna put redstone torches in here After we got this, we go to the other side and now we leave a two block gap from the from the end, like one, two, and there we can dig out two blocks deep again. And obviously also put in redstone, flag, uh, redstone torches again. Then we go and cover this area again with dirt. And next we need powered rails and normal rails. We're gonna start here on the hoppers, place four, and then we have to place like oh everywhere for uh, from the hoppers and um, four on the other end here and then connect them with uh, with normal rails oh they are messed up obviously it's had it ha has to be a row like a straight row there we go and now finish the whole area up with this layer so there we go very simple system um, in the next step, we're gonna take our minecarts with a hopper, very important, no normal minecarts. And um, first cover this area here, otherwise the minecarts will drop off there. And then just place them here in a row. And then, yeah, okay, let's do this one there and ju just walk on them and they're gonna start running back and forth. You see, there we go. And now they are ready to collect some bamboo. So next we have to find the exact middle and um, it's like from this side nine blocks and from the other side also nine blocks and place two blocks then in middle like I've d did here and then build them to the to the other side. So there we go and then we go to this end here and place one row here like this and yeah just a half and on the other side we do the other side here. So now it should look like this. Then we have to also build two more rows of building blocks here, like exchange the dirt here on both sides, very important, like first here. And then also on the other side. Now it should look like this. 
So, next we have to fill up these areas here with dirt. So there we go, and now we have to build a, sp a small frame out of glass around the farm. So, there we go. Next, we're gonna start with the flying machine. We go here and place these three blocks in this pattern here. Take obsidian, place it right here, and the redstone lamp right here. Then we take a sticky piston and place it in front of the obsidian here and the slime block and then put some temporary blocks here to put the observer with the face. No, oh, this is this one was wrong. With the face towards the farm. So or with the red dot towards the slime. So like this. Then we have to repeat the same on the other side. Right here. Sticky piston, slime block, and then the observer looking towards the red zone lamp this time. So then take eight slime blocks and build them out here. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then a glass block on the end. And we have to repeat this on the other side as well. So there we go. And now we need a button and place it right here. This is our manual start here for the, far, uh, for the system. Then put two glass blocks right there and two building blocks, uh, four building blocks right here. Then take two temporary blocks over here and two observers on top of them, both facing towards the farm. Take redstone repeaters and place them right here and put them on the third level, like one, no, one, two, three. There we go. And then three redstone right here. So then it should look like this. Remember the entrance will be probably on a different spot here, but just take this middle line because this is like the exact middle of the farm now. Because now we go to the back of the farm and remove like this block in front of the observer here and put down one obsidian right here. Then take a glass block, put it here and another obsidian right here. Now we need a redstone torch, put it below the upper obsidian here and the repeater like here, right here on the third level again. Now take a lever, put it right oh, back here and activate it. And then go up, go in front of this obsidian here and put an observer right here. We need some temporary blocks for this one. And don't forget to remove the temporary blocks. Then put glass block right here and two right here. So the machine is ready now and now we have to plant the bamboo all over the dirt. So there we go. Now it should look like this. Now we have to wait until every bamboo has grown at least once so it's not the seedling anymore because we will use some water later and uh, Otherwise, they will just get floated away and get destroyed. So wait until every bamboo has grown at least once. So now you see we just have, have the grown bamboo here. You see no seedlings here anymore. So now we can start with the water. Now, so take the water, go here and place it on the, these corners here. The, the pattern is not that important because, uh, yeah, you see the bamboo is getting floated into the into the areas where the minecarts are collecting them. And don't forget the other side, obviously. So this should be fine. And you see as soon as uh, the bamboo reaches like this line here, like yeah, it will get collected by the minecarts. So, the last step is just to build a six wall, a six block high wall. So expand this one by six glass, three, four, five, six, and do this all around the farm. So there we go. Um, yeah, the far farm is now ready to go, and it should look like this.
So now we're gonna start building the collecting system a bit, like dig out a little bit more space here because we have built above it. Just make a bit room for you. And then just build some more chests with hoppers. Depends on how long you wanna use it and how much, uh, how much wood you're gonna need. So there we go, four chests should be enough for now. And now I'm gonna make a one, uh, I'm gonna go AFK for one hour and show you the results. Um, and you could also, by the way, put uh, put the hoppers down and uh, every single hopper leading into a chest or leading them right into uh, some furnaces or stuff, you cre can be creative with that. So let's start the one hour, AF one hour AFK session. So, we were AFK now for one hour. Obviously, this wasn't the video material of one hour. This would have been taken too long, but let's see. You see, okay, the first chest is full. Oh, the second as well. The third as well, what the fuck? And this one almost filled. Like, uh, I personally haven't tested it and I ha wouldn't have expected this much bamboo from this one hour. It's, uh, let me calculate real quick. It should be around 14,000 uh, bamboo here. We also have some bamboo in the hoppers. Um, but yeah, pre pretty good, I would say. Um, yeah, very effective farm uh, for not that much of effort. And especially now you have a full automatic wood farm. And now you can obviously take a crafting table, take the bamboo and just craft it. There we go. And then you have some block of bamboo and then we have bamboo planks. So infinite wood forever. Very, cr very, very awesome because it's just possible since this update earlier needed it like a duper and everything. But now you can just build a fully automatic wood farm and I love this one. So that's the end of the video. I really hope you liked it. If you did, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next video. Bye.